So here we go. There's our new camper. It's the Zeppelin by Keystone. There you go. That's the back side opposite of where the door is. You can see both tents are out. It's got two propane tanks. There's our battery pack up front. I had to put a new battery on it. There's the queen size bed. And there's the door. And the double size bed. We'll go inside. There's the door steps. We'll turn the lights on. There you can see the double bed all set up. And inside here is the bathroom. There you can see the handsome videographer. Right down there is the, I guess you call it a bathtub, but it's pretty small. More of a shower, skylight, and we got the fan where you can turn it on. And the vent. And there's the stereo, another vent. There's the countertop, lots of countertop space. So there's the oven, full oven and stove top. Double sink with a cutting board. And there's the microwave with a stove top fan. And there's our fridge, nice size fridge. It's not quite level in here right now, that's why the door is swinging. There's the freezer, and it's both electric and gas. So it, uh, it will run on either. So it'll run on the battery with gas, or it'll run on uh, 110. And there's the thermostat for the furnace. And there's the furnace right there, and down below that is the electrical panel. And above that, on the ceiling, on the deck head, is the air conditioning unit. It works fairly good. And above there you've got the uh, carbon monoxide alarm. And we've already put our little TV in. Over there is the uh, smoke alarm, and we've got an LP gas alarm down there and electrical sockets and this folds down into a double bed and this here couch here is like a click clack couch where it actually folds out and it's supposed to be a double but it's probably more a single and there you can see the uh, nice size queen size bed and it's all very cozy some of the uh, cupboard spaces are all clean empty we haven't loaded all with our camper gear yet, and that's the uh, hand crank for the antenna for the TV. And there's Jakey sitting yeah. down, enjoying his uh, stay in the RV. And there's the manual, and a couple of nice windows, lots of light in here. It's quite nice. I can't see. Yeah. Oh, and there's the uh, privacy curtain that goes across. We've got similar privacy curtains right there and there for the uh, queen size so people can stay up and people can go to bed. And there you have it. That's a grand tour of the Flats new hybrid camper. And there's Jake taking out the thing. There's the couch turned into the click clock bed. And Jake is just putting down the bed right there. Well, that's pretty sturdy. And then you put the cushions, I guess. Is no, no, cushions, small cushions go in the middle. Shut up. Better knee. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. That goes like that. Yeah, I guess you can just put these underneath. And there you have it. There's more bunk space. If you really had to, uh, uh, and does it fit you? It's a little bit short, eh? Kind of tall. And, well, I guess it kind of fits. So Hannah would fit, fit it better. Well, I fit on this one, actually, quite nicely.
They're both the same length. No, this one's a little bit shorter because it's Oh yeah, that's true. But you could sit, sleep on it diagonally. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah, that would work. I take my bed. Yeah, so you don't even need to have the queens out in order to uh, the queen or the uh, other bed out to sleep in the tent trailer in the camper if you absolutely wanted to. And over here is a shelf as well, so you can actually pop that up and put a TV on it. Apparently. There's a cable input and a power cord. Very cool.